it looks like this. You have two of them? This one and this one. This one's gonna go in here. Like this? And the other one's gonna go in the other side. At the Boulder, Colorado Public Library, Ken Fowler is a popular member of a club called the Boulder Folders. It doesn't really matter which way you do it, you just have to do them all the same each time. And this is called interlocking rings. Do you believe that's one piece of paper? Yes. The Boulder Folders is one of 70 U.S. and nearly 50 international origami clubs, all filled with people who love to fold. I think getting together and folding is a lot more fun than doing it by yourself. The group's director, Barbara Gardner, says she appreciates Ken Fowler's enthusiasm. Ken is really motivated. He's uh, a good learner. He's done a lot of things to uh, figure out how to fold things. He's learned to read diagrams, and he has become a wonderful teacher. Adults with mental health issues ranging from major depression to schizophrenia are also benefiting from Fowler's teaching. Peter Cholosky is a staff member at Chinook Clubhouse. Chinook Clubhouse is a place of recovery for people with mental illness, and we guarantee that people will find meaningful work here. Ken Fowler says that origami helped him find meaning three years ago when he was hospitalized for depression and medication was not helping enough. Some of his doctors recommended electroshock therapy. While he was deciding whether to agree to that treatment, an art therapist at the hospital introduced him to origami. You can, you can really relax with it. There's no hurry. It's not competitive. Fowler eventually declined the shock therapy. He still takes antidepressants, but he says he is certain doing origami helped his depression lift. Fowler says a documentary about origami by Vanessa Gould called Between the Folds also inspired him to learn more about the ancient art and how to teach it to other people. If you can't figure out where you're at and, and you're you're wondering where you're at in your life if you just unfold it. Fowler says so that's that just like origami. You can always origami. roll out the creases, that's, unfold that's where you're at, and start folding to make a new pattern. Uh, in addition to his volunteer work with Chinook Clubhouse and the Boulder Folders, he's been hired to teach origami classes at community centers. In the process, a new career has unfolded. For VOA News, I'm Shelley Schlender in Boulder, Colorado. No. Flowers? Those are fun, but I know how to do those. Do you know how to do those?